one of the things that uh, the United States is experiencing at the present time is a shortage of sodium bicarbonate uh, in the hospital setting. For those who are bakers, so you look at this and you say, sodium bicarbonate? Are you serious? I can go to, the, I can go to King Supers and, and get sodium bicarbonate right off the shelf. How can there possibly be a shortage of this? But the manufacturing process for this does not have a lot of extra capacity. Uh, and when one of the plants went down earlier this year, uh, they started rationing sodium bicarbonate. It is a, a basic substance, so it's used to treat patients who have excess acidity in their body. The, one of the forms in which it's used is an emergency syringe that's used in patients who have some sort of a cardiac event. And uh, when hospitals don't have enough of that, they get really nervous that this a cardiac event might occur in one place and they wouldn't have some available. Uh, the other uh, context in which it's used is elective surgeries. And when there's a shortage of this, sometimes uh, hospitals will not be able to schedule all the elective surgeries that they want. Uh, this is an issue across the country. Some hospital pharmacies are able to accommodate uh, uh, for this uh, by making their own sodium bicarbonate. Of, of course, it's, it's not difficult to make, but when it's made, it needs to be tested. Uh, so we were recently approached uh, with the, the project, you know, could we test sodium bicarbonate if some of the local hospitals chose to make their own? So we use a pH meter and uh, put sodium bicarbonate solution in that and add measured amounts of acid, a, a standard acid solution. Uh, and by those changes in pH, it will tell us how much of the sodium bicarbonate is in their preparations. It can help keep the hospital so it has enough of a supply that uh, patient care is, is uninterrupted. I think it's important for schools of pharmacy to be ready to step in and, and help the practice community when they can. And this is just one small thing that uh, we do at the Skag School of Pharmacy and Pharmaceutical Sciences.